What's good, y'all? We back, and today we coming to y'all with a cooking video. Oh, <laughs> what's on the menu? What's on the menu? For on the menu, we got some chicken thighs. We got them thawing out right now. We gonna marinate them up, have them looking crazy. But what's the side? What are we eating with the thighs? I got you. I got oh, you. Okay. Let me. Let me. We gonna have some rice, some jasmine rice. I'm saying this her favorite rice. She put me on. It's some good rice. Y'all should try it out. Cornbread. Can't go wrong with the cornbread. I just found out it's pork in that today. And also, don't make fun of our boiling bag rice. Simpler and it's quicker. <laughs> and the Jiffy Mix had pork oh, yeah. in it. Because we seen a, vegetari a vegetarian version like... What kind of? It say it say like in the ingredients it say it contain lard. I think that's how you said. And lard is pork. That's why they came out with the vegetarian cornbread mix. And then we gonna have some broccoli, y'all. Just some regular, some broccoli. And what you get this out for? The chicken. Ooh, I'm make this thirty okay. minutes chicken. Hold on, I ain't even. We got this new injected injectable Creole style butter. We yeah. love Creole seasoning, so. Throw this shit up in the chicken thigh. <laughs> we gonna try that. And also, I'm making a non-dairy strawberry cheesecake. Mm. I don't eat dairy products, so I'm excited because this is my first time doing it. But he finna start marinating the chicken, and then we gonna shower and come back. And this by the nigga who make the Creole, too. Dope. These are all our seasonings. I'm gonna leave them all in the description below. If you guys are interested in the recipe, I'll leave it all in the description. After we get all our seasonings, we're gonna season everything up to your liking. No specifics on the seasoning and the amounts. Just make it look good. Make sure you're massaging your chicken, get it all up under the skin, just so you can get flavor everywhere. What am I doing? First of all, put the needle. Where'd the needle go? Oh, you ain't telling me it was a needle. Get that shit up Oozing on. You didn't hear that first when you started pressing. See it blowing up? Damn. Damn. <laughs> Are we feeling that moment? I did this one? No. Now let's refill our syringe. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. You better than me because I was about to pour that shit. <laughs> then I remember taking Pepto Bismol as a kid, and that's how she always do it. You're funny. So <laughs> talking about Pepto Bismol. Get up in there, Dr. Dr. Key. So you get in there, uh -huh. and the meat under the skin. See, that shit's flipping up. Damn. Now we put it in the oven on 400 for 50 minutes. Hey, y'all, so now we finna make the strawberry cheesecake. And this is my first time, so I got the recipe right here. But basically, we got the graham cracker crust. We got plant-based cream cheese. Shit. Two eggs. Lemon juice, vanilla ash drag. That's the strawberry stuff going on top. We got sugar, got big bowl, and we got first thing first, preheat the oven to what you say? 350. The oven's already preheated. Now we're finna just open up these and put it in the bowl. I wanna taste it. Let's see it. Just look like white. I'm gonna tell you that. Cream cheese. Wow. Pop that bad boy in there. Ain't wasting none. This shit is expensive. Seven dollars for that little thing. There's about room for it, ain't it? It's not even, it's not cold no more. Get it out. I'm trying, I'm just making sure I get all of it. None to waste. Once all the cream cheese is in there, you need a cup of sugar. Mix it basically until it's smooth. Say add the egg after after it's smooth. Is <laughs> you trying to get all off the sides? Mm. That big ass bowl. That feel pretty good. Big feel. That's an epic feel. Best. Be careful, cause that bitch might fall. I know that. Stop. <laughs> Add an egg one at a time. Mix when that's the when that egg is done mixing. Add another egg, and when that one is done mixing, then you add the lemon juice and the vanilla extract. Look at that texture. This is a big bowl, y'all, and I'm not making a big thing. Good. We gonna add our next egg. Blend again. One teaspoon of lemon juice and one teaspoon of the. I said a teaspoon. One tablespoon. What the lemon gonna do? You what you, you do? What you think it's gonna do? Yeah, flavor. Okay, with the nails. Let's see. What the fuck? <laughs> oh. 
falling. That's a lot, ain't it? That bitch better stop falling. If it don't stand up on its own. You need that. Vanilla good. I love vanilla. Vanilla. And then we blend again. That's way better than doing it by hand, ain't it? It's your left handed butt. That bitch gonna be thick. I know, I could have got the bigger one. That's gonna spread out nice, mm -hmm. Put your legs all up in it. <laughs> Thighs looking good as shit. <laughs> You're so fucking silly. You sniffing? <laughs> Trying to smell it? No, I'm breathing. <laughs> I'm, I feel like my nose is finna run. You funny. Right. That's spread it. Mm -hmm. What's next? Put it After in the oven. this, it go in the oven, but we gotta wait. It's been 30 minutes, so it's time to flip the chicken. That was good. Halfway done. You wanna drain some of that oil out? Hey y'all, so we just flipped the chicken and drank the excess oil, grease, whatever. And we're waiting to put that in the oven and we finna make the cornbread. Then he's going to make his sauce for the chicken. Once that's done, then we get to the sauce. <laughs> one egg, one third. Ooh. Egg, and y'all know I don't do dairy, so we gonna use milk. I promise you won't even taste the difference. Almond milk actually tastes better than regular milk, honestly. <laughs> I know. Wait, one more thing. Come spray these pans with non-stick spray. <laughs> Why are you in the background? <laughs> Come spray the pan. Never mind. Never mind. I'll do it. One third. One third. Sugar and y'all cornbread or not, but I do. So we're gonna do that. Yeah. <laughs> Not everybody do. They don't do that when they use making cornbread for like stuffing and stuff. For dressing, yeah. I know, but some people don't put it in regular cornbread. You just eat fucking bread. It's like a tasteless cake. Whisk. Plastic spray, spray the pan. The pan you putting it in down. Now we're about to make our sauce. Start off about that much butter. Don't know how much for real, for real, but I like this enough. And get our butter up in there. Next, while we got that butter on there, we got our minced garlic. That's we're gonna need a lot of minced garlic. Next, we got our garlic and herb paste. Let's mix this up a little bit. Now we're gonna add us our honey. Got a little bit of lemon juice. Mix that up some more. Mm. It's really the butter. Last thing we gonna add is our lemon butter garlic seasoning by Kinders. Throw a generous amount up in there. Cause this that taste we like right here. Gave yeah, some color, that should smell good too. Now we gonna add some more butter just so we can have a little bit more. We should get one of them brushes. Cause I, when I think about it, I'm like, we use a lot of shit. We, we are gonna use it for real. You could use it for our Just pizza like crust. Pizza. I'm gonna put it in there longer. I want my shit. We can Darker. Do, we can throw it in the air fryer. We took them out the oven and we're gonna throw them in the air fryer so they can crisp up for real, for real. A few moments later. Putting the strawberries on the cheesecake. And then it's going to refrigerate overnight. I forgot to record me doing the strawberries. It's okay. Sorry. Just put some sugar in it, heat it up in the pan for a little bit. And then put it in, in the overnight. fridge. Ready then you put it in the fridge overnight. It's, it could be a couple hours or you can do it overnight. But since I did it later in the day, it's going to be overnight. Mmm. Okay, y'all, so we finna eat. Plate is looking crazy, y'all. Go ahead, right. try it. Here we go. Look at this. 
tiny lips. How it Man. tastes. Crazy. It's like, it's sweet, it's savory. You got the lemon, butter, garlic, garlic, pepper. Mm. Juicy chicken thigh. <laughs> Let's see. How it tastes? The rice good. Broccoli good. Mm. Well, we got rice, broccoli, cornbread. Man, them chicken taste so crazy. My reaction for the chicken? Yeah. Take a bite out that chicken. That's what we want to see. Cornbread. Mm. Cornbread, nice and sweet. Mm -hmm. We like to put sugar in our cornbread. If you don't, you're missing out. Made with almond milk. Everything dairy free. The cheesecake cooler. Is it hot? Yeah. It ain't hot. Girl, eat it. Talk about you. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Nice bite. Mm. That's good. The honey add a nice little. That's what I'm saying. I'm glad I added that extra honey to that sauce. Mm. Mm. Put the sauce on there. We put the sauce on there and then we threw it in the air fryer for like another five minutes let it cook and crisp up on there and it tastes good man i'm gonna leave all the ingredients that we use in the description and make sure y'all boys drop a like bye, bye.